self-confidence can have magical effects on a person's potential, but sometimes it's hard to grasp, especially when you're in sixth grade. I have certain things that I like about myself, but there's some things I don't like, like my, my haircuts and stuff. Yadiel Gonzalez was one of many students attending Aviano Middle School's anti-bullying assembly, hosted by Roxy Diaz the of BET's 106 in Park. Don't know how to react to kindness. We see a lot of kids back in the States right now. It's like an epidemic, especially when it comes to cyberbullying. She aims to send the kids an important message. Just try to be influential and keeping positive, staying positive, knowing how to stick up for people, knowing what it really is to be a bully, and knowing what some of the consequences can be. If you ever have to change something about yourself to fit in or to be friends with somebody, that person is not your friend. You guys get that? Yeah? Roxy's words left an impression on at least one student. Hi. I think I am a nerd myself. I get good grades, I wear glasses, but I think being called a nerd is not bad. You feel better about yourself because that means you have good things to compliment yourself, like you have good grades. Whereas most children strive to be more like their idols, Yadiel says that's not for him. I want to be, I'm thinking, I, ha I don't have, I think I, I just want to stay by myself. I don't want to be like anybody else. I want to be myself. And his advice to fellow students? Don't be bullied. That saw me out of it. And try to stay away from them. Children like Yadiel are learning vital life lessons. And role models like Roxy Diaz, parents and teachers can have a huge impact on the outcome. Senior Airman Brian Biggie, Aviano exactly. Air Base. What goes around comes around. Italy. So if you're mean to somebody, somebody else can be mean to you.